that's a, that's a great start, you guys. Like, um, I really, I, I quite like the, the artwork and kind of what you've done with the stylized piece there. Um, and there's something fun going on with the, with the hero, it looks like, like the way he's going to have these different pieces. Um, I'm, I'm missing a little context, right? Like, I'm not sure what he's doing exactly, or how he's sort of teleporting back and forth, left to right, or the difference between his, his cane and his sword and those pieces there, but, um, but I can see where you've kind of started with something that could build from there. That, that's uh, something between, between the old man and the guy who can fight, and et cetera, that uh, they could all come out. Um, just think about, again, I, I mentioned it in the last one too, like the, that idea of the player feedback. Like, I want to know what's going on. Like, I need a little more context given to me so I can, so I can really enjoy what it is you put together. All right, thank you very much. So, um, on my end, this is kind of my of those of uh, low res uh, flash games on Newgrounds 10 years ago. I mean, that's a compliment because Newgrounds was awesome at that. It's all about congregate now and all that. Um, it, I love the art style, it's definitely quite consistent, quite uh, interesting. Although it kind of does clash with the uh, sort of pixely uh, title screen. Um, but uh, that's not really a thing. Uh, the switch between, the mechanic switch between uh, adults and uh, old man, I found quite interesting. Definitely see how you that to, to uh, influence the game world, you know, we can all to. The only thing was that um, I wasn't quite sure why uh, buildings with people were going to send the jacks around on the way. And I think if you, you can explain to me now, or that's what the point is more about, you won't allow the game to communicate to the player. So, you know, more we have to say is don't, don't let the uh, player guess it. You know, at least explain to him why that is. That's all right. Thank you very much. And the thing that I would add is basically to kind of so what's already been said is kind of giving more narrative context for what's going on. So like, why is a single old man being the one defending the town? Um, when, you know, where did everyone else go? Um, the, some of these buildings are falling apart. So did something happen here? Did the, um, I forget what you call them. The Ganoplins. Ganoplins, yeah. So did they destroy this town partially? Or, um, so basically providing us with more context for what, you know, what's in this world, what's going on. Um, and basically, why do I care? This is essentially what it is. Like, why do I care about being the old man and, and defending the town? Thank you. I, I thought the uh, animation of the character, like the attacks, made, made him feel really old, which is great. Um, and likewise, getting the cane out and walking around with the cane, I thought that was a fun way to address the theme. Um, the design of the enemies was uh, pretty entertaining. See those work really well, but they didn't seem to do a whole lot. Um, so the, the core gameplay seems like it needs a little more development. Uh, I also really enjoyed the art style of the game. It uh, reminded me a lot of early Flash games, which is cool. So uh, one thing I've noticed is that so whenever a game gets developed by E3, uh, well, let's be honest, a lot of us are orchestrated to kind of show what needs to be shown. And one thing I've kind of noticed is that you've got the three heart system and the health system. I don't think we ever saw. How it gets you in any way. It's a case of, as long as you see more like blue dress and then that. And so, I think for, if you never like to do it, keep in mind of what you're showing on the screen and make sure you know what it's there for. Alright. I think we were hit earlier, but the potion heals back up. Ah, so. Uh, yeah, so I, I enjoyed your demonstration here. Um, I like the artwork as well, uh, definitely early Flash game style. Uh, uh, I would note that a little more uh, context or, or some sort of thematic elements other than just having the main character being within the theme would be useful in terms of designating, okay, this is what's going on, uh, getting a story going. Uh, I thought the artwork was well done uh, in the animation sense. Uh, I know that's not uh, the easiest thing. Uh, and overall, I thought he did a pretty good job. Definitely needs a little more uh, polish on mechanics, but definitely a really good start. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys.